Good day, everybody. This is BA Radian Dawn, and I'm back with another legendary or mythic. This I think this month is mythic banner reaction. Uh, I'm pretty excited to see who's on it. This banner looked fire in terms of re uh, returning units. I'm curious to see who else is on the banner. Let's freaking rock and roll, shall we? So let's see. New legendary and mythics. Wait, double? We get a legendary and a mythic? What the hell? Okay. Ew. Ow. God, that face. Fire legendary. Okay, so she's a fire legendary. And green tome. Pair up. Why is she a legendary though? Okay, uh, Grim Rocker. Enables Canto 2 during turns 1 through 4. If unit initiates combat or is not adjacent to an ally, inflicts attack res minus 6 on the foe during combat, and unit makes a guaranteed follow-up attack. So she's going to be probably be slow as all hell, but she's going to hit like a truck. Attack res rain, attack res solo, divine recre recreation. Yeah, she's going to be tanky. Uh, Divine Recreation. At start of combat, a foe's HP is greater than 50%. Spectrum minus 4 during combat. Reduces defend damage from foe's first attack during combat by 30%. Boosts unit's next attack by total damage reduced by any source, including other skills. Resets at the end of combat. So wait, what? At start of combat, if foe's HP is greater than 50%, it flicks Spectrum minus 4 on foe during combat. Reduces damage from foe's first attack during combat by 30%. Boosts unit's next attack by total damage reduced. By any source, including other skills. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> and when she attacks, she's gonna do a Canto thing. So we can see her stats. Yeah, pair up. Yo, okay. And Mythic Thor? My name is Thor. True strength is what I seek. Astra, okay. Oh, Flow Guard. Guard just got freaking Power Crept. Holy shit, okay. Uh, War God, Mjolnir. Uh, effective against our armored foes, start of combat, here's HP is greater than 25%, we've already seen that before, bonfire, attack, defense, push 4, flow guard 3 is a new guard skill that's power crept to hell. If unit initiates combat, neutralizes effects that prevent units follow up attacks and inflict special cooldown charge. So they get, uh, anti-wind sweep, and guard in the same slot. Okay, that's really freaking good actually. And World Breaker. Grant special cooldown charge plus one per attack during combat to unit and allies within two spaces? What? It's a freaking two... Um... It's... It's... It's a drive. It's a... It's basically drive blade. Heavy blade or flashing blade? It's a drive blade? That's insane. That is literally insane. Oh my god. She's so good. She's so good. And they're both green! Yo, green is crazy! This is a good green pool, man! So, it's Dogger, Eitri, Thor, and green. Green is god tier. It's god tier. You can't go wrong if you summon on green. Okay, let's see who else is on this banner. Whoo! Okay, Bramimon, yeah, we already know. Corn, yeah, we already know. Plumeria, yeah, we already know. Dimitri, yeah, we already know. Dagger, we already know. Sigurd, we already know. Dimitri. Oh, we got both Dimitris after all. Okay, that's interesting. I wasn't expecting us to get both Dimitris. Legendary Micaiah, okay. Moose spell? 
Moose Bell and not Marth? Okay, so we got a really good pool. You can't go wrong with any of the colors. Like, who's the worst character? Legendary Dimitri? And he's got good fodder too. Moose Bell is pretty solid. Micaiah. God, this is a really good pool. Green is nuts, by the way. Green is insane. Uh, colorless is probably the weakest color, unfortunately. But even colorless is hard to lose on. But like blue is got is pretty good with um, attack speed menace and both Dimitri's. Not uh, red, Plumeria, Moose Spell, and Sigurd. I can't remember what Moose Spell comes with in terms of fodder, but I think he comes with something decent. Let me just double check on that for a second here. This is looking like a really solid pool. Wait, did he actually come with Dragon Wall before? Yeah, he's got Dragon Wall. Okay, so we got Dragon Wall, double Dragon Walls on this banner, which is pretty cool. Uh, Legendary Micaiah has what again? She has Fury 4 and Disting, Joint Disting Guard. That's pretty solid. Brimamon doesn't really have anything for fodder, but he's just a really solid character. Um, the Fallen Dimitri, I can't remember what he has for fodder. Uh, let me look that up for a quick, in a quick, just for a quick second here. And Legendary Dimitri as well. I'll take a look at. So Fallen Dimitri for fodder has what? I will tell you all in just one moment. So he's got attack speed solo four. And he's got Odd Tempest, which is not great. Uh, Dimitri Legendary has... I think he comes with, like, Sturdy Impact or something, right? Yeah, Sturdy Impact and Odd Tempest. So move, double movement skills in blue along with Attack Speed Menace, which is crazy. Uh, Plumeria, Sigurd is an absolute monster. I don't need to go over his skills. He's just a really good unit. The green pool is really good. Um, if I were to take, if I, uh, for me personally, green is pretty solid, but I'm going after red and blue. I need red and blue. I need Menace and I need, um, Sigurd. I wouldn't mind merges on my move spell, but I'm never, I'm not using them anyway. But green is looking really good. I'm not gonna lie. Green is looking solid. Uh, yeah, so, uh, who are you guys gonna pull for? Let me know down in the comment section below, and, um, yeah, um, are you excited about this banner? Uh, I'm gonna be doing a summoning session on this banner and the Double Special Heroes banner, so, uh, I'd look forward to that. And, uh, in the meantime, if you enjoyed this video, like, comment, subscribe, and until next time, this is Beaver Dot signing off. Bye! See you, everybody.